Okay, so Jimmy has finally come back. This is like an hour and a half after his last visit. What do you want now? Do you want some of this? Because you didn't finish eating your last lot. Here, do you want some of this? Come on, here. Look, there's your chicken. I kept it for you. Do you want it? No, you probably don't, do you? Okay, here, take this. There's one. And there's two. Okay, off he goes. We'll see who turns up next. I was just sat in my porch because I'm very hot and I thought I'd sit here in the cool. And I was just doing some of my comments because I'm very behind on comments at the moment. Wasn't paying attention, looks up and who's here? The boy. Here, one. Two. So very wary. Come on then, Jim. Good boy. I think somebody's coming down the road. Well, that was a quick visit. Bye then. Thanks for coming. Look who's back. I think the song is Slim Shady's Back. Jimmy. Now, yeah, couple. And off he goes. Just came to check on these two and they're both asleep in that box there. So I'm going back out so that they don't start waking up because I'm here. Look who's back. Slim Shady's back. I'm not singing to you guys, so I just thought I'd say it. Right, Jim. Here. Yeah. Come on. And I think you need to take a rest. Because we've nearly gone through that kilo again just on you. Jim. Come on then, Norman. Come on, in. Norms, come on. You can't come to the door, then stop. You don't want that chicken. Come on, quick. All right, there's Jimmy. All right, Norman, in you go. Jimmy's got his chicken. Happy days. And off he goes again. Okay, so Chip Chip and um, Cookie are both here together. How lovely is this? Chip, come on. Chip Chip. No, oh, she's gone off up the road. I just happened to look up at the camera and they were both here. Good boy. Can I just take that cellophane off there? Hold on a second. Well done, mate. You'll be on my lap in a minute, won't you? Yeah. Do you want some more? Let me give, put some out on your plate here. Yeah. Good boy. Chip, chip. I don't know where she went running off to. Oh, there she is. Come on then, Chip. Here. Come on, my babe. That's right, Cookie. It's just for Chip Chip. Good girl. Get them both in the screen. There we go, Chip. Sorry, nearly hit you on the head, mate. Didn't I? Nearly got you on the head. Do you want your chicken? There we go. There we are. He 
Who knows? You want the third piece as well, don't you? Right, this is it gone now. I'm going to have to go and get some more for Chip Chip. You can't have a fourth piece because that carton is now empty. Unless you want to stand and wait. Do you want to wait? No, he says I'll go. Right, Chip Chip, wait there and I'll come back in a second, my baby. Hold on. Let me just put that here a second and hopefully she won't go nowhere. I think. Right, hopefully that'll be okay. Right, let's give her some of this other chicken. There you go, my babes. I'll be back in a sec. Just gotta get chicken for you, darling. Yeah. Come on, baby. Yeah. Chip, chip. Right. I'm back with chicken. Here we go, my baby. Oops. Don't you want to be looking at the ground, do you? There we go. Come on. Chip. Yeah, I'm normally better prepared than that and have it out here ready, but with it getting warmer, I don't want to be storing it in the porch because it will go off. Not that it'll probably bother the foxes, but when it goes off, it stinks. You're just taking the one, my darling. There's another one here for you. Can we get the other one? No? Yeah. Well done, my babe. Okay, there we go. That was Cookie and Chip Chip. So it's half past ten now, and we've seen Jimmy, Cookie, and Chip Chip, which has been good. So I'm now going to put the rest of the food out for the others to come along because if they do see me, they run. Apart from Pip, but I haven't seen him tonight. I'll put out some chicken wings because Jimmy is bound to come and grab them all. Uh, but I will be keeping some back for later before I go to bed. So I'm going to sit indoors now, check on the cubs, etc. And see what I can capture from that bottom camera rather than keep getting up and down now. So let's see what happens. Both sleeping like babies. Simon is in the box and Magoo is over the back there next to the fox teddy. Anyway, light off again, leave them sleep. It's 11.15 um, and I'm going to put the rest of the chicken out now uh, because Magoo isn't very well at the moment. He had a little bit of a seizure earlier on in the day but he's been fine ever since and he's just had a, another one so I really need to keep an eye on him. He's with Carol at the moment. Hopefully he's going to be fine but he's very, very tired at the moment so I'm putting the rest of the chicken out and... If I don't capture anything now on the bottom camera, it will be whatever we capture on the overnight, okay? So I'm going to say good night and I'll see you all tomorrow. So Simon has now woke up as well. He's just been a little bit mischievous at the moment, pulling things around. Whereas Magoo 
He's just laid here in my arms at the moment. He's really, really tired, but he seems to be a little bit better than what he was a few minutes ago. All I can do is keep an eye on him. Bless his heart. Just come back in to check on them both. Magoo's the one at the back and Simon's got his head laid on Magoo's legs. Magoo's okay. He's just very, very tired at the moment. So I will keep checking on him throughout the night. So Magoo is now awake and he's the one that is eating. Obviously Pip's awake as well, but it's two o'clock in the morning. Oh, and it's such a relief to see him up and about and eating something. Whatever happened earlier on really knocked it out of him, bless him. But fingers crossed it's not going to happen again. It scared the living daylights out of me. I say he seems to be okay at the moment, so I'm just going to leave the two of them in here for the moment. And I'll come back and check on them again soon.